Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars. And according to an author named Ed Klein, Obama is setting up a shadow government to undermine Trump at every turn. I guess he's rented a big, big house. They rented an eight bedroom mansion in the section of Washington near Joe Lockhart. Bill Clinton's last press secretary. And that house there's enough room for Valley Jarrett and Michelle and the kids. Place park for ten cars parked. They're getting setting up what they call they are calling a shadow government. This is according to Ed Klein, an author. Uh, apparently, is more than known most of us. That's not the real reason they're staying there. Uh, okay, uh, Pete Hem Hegsworth, Hegsworth, Obama's claim it's because they, your children want to stay in D.C. Ed Klein, that's not real reason they're staying there. They're staying there because despite what the President said in his press conference, he has a sense of outrage over this incoming Trump administration, which he thinks is going to wipe out his leg legacy. So, he's setting up this kind of almost insurgency, picking people in foreign affairs, labor, abortion, union matters, and setting them up to start appearing on TV, making speeches and doing op-ed pieces for the next four years. You're going to always, not only see the Trump administration, but you're going to see a shadow government opposing the Trump. Well, this one surprised me in the least. These people... This is the way communists work. They uh, hate any type of opposition. This is where you get a fake news thing from. When people will talk about fake news. Really what they're trying to do is eliminate First Amendment. They're trying to eliminate any political opposition. That's what this that's the entire thing. So, it looks like, assuming that we make it okay through the inauguration, which is less than clear at this point, uh, this looks like it's going to be a rough ride. In a related story, I, uh, I've heard some other information which I have not researched yet. I'm Artifacts Mars. Thanks for watching.